So you were living rent free. Right. Gas, utilities, everything else free. Right. You were working other jobs. Yes. And Mr. Straw says that this remodel job was supposed to be finished in three months, but now he has you around July, August, September, October, November, December, January, February, March, April. He has you around 10 months, not paying rent. Was the renovation complete? Uh, as agreed uh, bup, upon. Bup, before you, bup, bup, before you, was the renovation complete yes. when you left? Yes. So you left on to set. Listen, we know you didn't leave under satisfactory terms, Mr. Ayola, because you were arrested right. for assault. And you were arrested for assault in April of 2017. He was the victim, by the way, correct? Correct. And you were arrested in April 2017, charged with assault, and that matter was, according to you in here, resolved. Yes. Well, I've been part of the judicial system for a very, very long time, and the criminal justice system. Case is either dismissed, you're convicted after a jury trial, you're convicted after a bench trial, or you enter a plea of guilty. Sometimes you can enter a plea of nolo contendere, which means if I went to trial, I would be found guilty, so I'll plead guilty to whatever, but I'm not pleading anything to specifically. How was your case resolved? I pled to disorderly you conduct. Pled, you pled guilty. To disorderly conduct. You pled guilty to disorderly conduct in a case that originated with the assault on Mr. Straw. Yes, I did. Okay. So you didn't leave under friendly circumstances. So if you say that the renovations were complete on the house, Mr. Rayola, why was there an assault? May I explain? Oh, let's go back. I'll withdraw that question from... In what month were the renovations complete? They were completed the end of May. The end of May? You weren't there in May. You left in April. Oh, I'm... Excuse me. I meant March. So... The renovations were finished in March. Correct. Beginning, middle, or end of March? Very end of March. Beyond what, I, what was agreed upon. What do you mean beyond what was agreed upon? Uh, the initial, the porch was not to be included whatsoever, and I had 125 hours into the porch that I put in as extra work. It needed renovation. It was in horrible condition. It's not you very You were living nice. there rent-free. It's fine. Where are you living now? I have an apartment. Where? In Bloomington, Minnesota. And who do you live with? I have a roommate. Okay. And what is the rent on the apartment? Sixteen hundred. A month. Yes, we split it. A month. And look, you were living in a whole house by a whole house, a five-bedroom house, for ten months, not paying a thing. It okay. was in deplorable condition when I moved in. That was your choice. Correct. What you're suing for are wages. Now, did anyone other than the plaintiff work on the renovation of your home? I, I helped uh, a just little bit. A, be careful what you say to me. That's you fine. know, I'm like a viper. Did anyone other than the plaintiff do the work on your house? I helped. When? Here I mean, and there. Did, here and there. Yeah, he did so most of it. He did, he did the work on the house. Most of it, yes. Now, you're no longer there. You're no right, longer right, in the house. Right. When did you and your son move out of the house? Months. Well, okay. Um, when did you move out of the house, young man? In the middle of the summer. Come I on. can't exactly remember. What? I'm sorry. I can't exactly it's remember It's right here. Month. We're talking about 10 years ago. What month did you move out, Mr. Straw? I believe it was June. Beginning, middle, and the end. And then I'm going to get the phone number from you of the tenant on the house. You moved out the beginning, middle, or the end of June? Uh, I started moving out the middle. Of June? Yes. And when did the tenant move in? The last week of June. And on what date was this confrontation with Mr. Ayola that he pled guilty to assault? And what date in April? 7th. Do you have receipts, bills, invoices from any other contractor who worked on your house after the 7th of April and before June? No. Were you employed from April in your business from April to June? Yes. What were you doing? I deliver sandwiches. All day? Pretty much. And you were working? Yes, ma'am. So that, let me figure this out. The house was in after the plaintiff left, reasonable enough shape for you to rent it at a profit. Yes, ma'am without employing anyone else to finish what he didn't do. And you work full time, so you didn't do it. Correct. And you didn't pay him anything. Correct. Judge him for the plaintiff in the amount of $5,000. We're finished. Thank you very much. Parties are excused. You may step out. I came home from work. He was frying a grilled cheese sandwich on my glass top stove without a frying pan. No, nothing at all like that. And he hit me. I said, you owe me $15,000. It's already done. I don't want to see that person again.